Hey everyone, Blue Shadow RP here, and I am back after a, I want to say, five to six day school hiatus because I went back to school for a week and yeah, and now I'm back. Um, and Splatoon also has another Splatfest for us, which is Autobots versus Decepticons, and I just went with Autobots because they were the good guys, but right now I'm thinking that Decepticons are going to win because, um... Because just basically I've lost a lot ma a lot of matches and uh, I don't know if that was just me playing poorly or if that was just my team not good enough or if the other team was just too good for us but it could have been a combination of all three anyways but um yeah I mean we got right in the left side so yeah but anyways, I just made it to where um, I'm Autobots champion, 96 out of 99 points, and thus I just need three more points, or at least four more points to get to Autobot King. And um, yeah, so I know I said I was going to be using the Slosher, but I decided to switch around my weapons a little bit, kind of get a different variety going on here. And uh, the stages that we have are Port Macarel, Salt, Salt Spray Rig. And Flounder Heights, but I think we already seen Salt Spray Rig and Port Macaroon in a nighttime environment, so but we haven't seen Flounder Heights yet. So maybe we'll get that on video. Hopefully we will. So yeah, let's get to Autobots King in this video if we can. And then I will make a second part after that. It's just doing a bit more gameplay. Wow, somebody's at level forty eight. Wow. That's probably the highest I've seen. Yeah, but probably when I'm going to reach level 50, we'll probably be around uh, Christmas time, or at least the holiday season, because I still have to go to school and stuff, but the first week of school wasn't bad, I mean, just knowing all the basics and stuff and getting back into it, yeah. Alright, so yeah, I was about to say if I wanted to edit, then I could, but they came already, so there are the Decepticon team, and uh, yeah, let's go, let's do this. Alright, we get Flounder Heights, so this is how basically Flounder Heights looks at night. Um, yeah, I basically get to see the cloudy sky or whatever. There it is. And then you can see all the apartment complexes and stuff like that. But yeah, we're a bunch of squid kids um, inking, inking the ground of the apartment complexes at night, so yeah. I think they also did say something about that in the Inkopolis news, like, is it okay to uh, cover all of the apartment complexes in ink, and like, well, the ink goes away after each match, so yeah. Okay, I guess they did have a point there. Yeah, and... Sorry if this video does go out a little late, because um, last night I was at, um, what is it, Autobot, Autobot Champion, and I only, I didn't get really that far into it, and then I just like, I was like a bit too tired, I guess, because I was on my school sleeping schedule, and then thus I just went to sleep, because I couldn't stay up any longer, so, yeah, I was more used to sleeping early, since I did go to sleep early a lot, so I can wake up early. I have to wake up extremely early on school days, which is ridiculous. So thus, I couldn't stay up enough to get um, Autobot Queen in one day, or in at least in a three and a half hour period, which is how I used to do it, but I don't think I'm going to be doing it that way from now on since I just went to sleep early. Okay. Oh, dang it. Not good. Alright, I'm actually going to step up my playstyle here and actually do something. Dang it. 
Yeah, I also did use the Aero Spray RG during this as well, but not by much since I also kept getting spotted by others as well. Okay. Wow, too many ink strikes. Oh, dang it, did not see that killer whale until the last second. And one last throw for good measure. I don't think we won that at all. Nope, not a chance. Five to five. Alright, well, the battle, I am down to get um, Autobot Queen, so let's just battle again with this team. If they come back. Okay, so we finally have a full team and a full opponent team, so let's do this. Dang it, we already have a Kraken chasing us. Dang it, I still managed to get splatted by that person that had it. And they're already going into our area, so that's not good. Ow. There. Oh, shoot, okay. I'm at least gonna cover as much turf as I can and try to get into their area at the same time. There we go. Oh, dang it. I did not stand a chance against that. But I think I went forward enough to get my the rest of my team through. I think my audio, my audio, and uh, my game audio and my mic level are pretty, be pretty much better now. Um, since when I recorded the Wii games about a week ago, um, they sounded a lot better. So I'm glad for that. Um, I'm not sure if that will still carry on to the Wii U, but we'll see. We'll see once this video goes up if that sounds any different. Ow. Oh shoot, that's not good. Yeah, people are always jumping to me since I'm the only one alive. Alright. Dang it. I tried to shoot him while jumping down, but it didn't work out since he had the slosher. Yeah, I don't know if the Decepticon people are a lot better. Or if we're just playing horribly, but I guess, yeah, like I said before, it can, it can be pretty much either one of those. Ow. Yeah, but we're gonna reach uh, Autobot King regardless, because I only have one more point, or two more points, whatever. If we lose anyways, so yeah. I don't know, like, it seems that, like, a lot more people seem to show up for the Splatfest rather than, you know, rank battle and just regular battle because I'm seeing, like, a lot of people. I don't even see any of the 
Japanese people at all, so like, I don't know where they are. Oh wait, yeah, I think I know why, because this is the North American Splatfest, so, okay. I don't know why I wasn't thinking about that, because they have their own Splatfest that they participate in. But, um, yeah, that's going to do it for part one, and in part two we'll do a little bit more gameplay, and then uh, I might record some Geometry Dash later, so yeah. We made it to Autobots Queen, max level, and uh, yeah. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you all enjoyed, please leave a like down below. It really does help support me and support the video. And with that, I will see you all for more future stuff. So anyways, thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful day, and goodbye.